Hey guys, and welcome on into today's MLB video play of the day. For more of this pick video content, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Also, check out our NBA video play of the day over at our YouTube channel. And also, for more pick content in general, head on over to our main website, stumpthespread.com, which I'll link in the video description. Over at stumpthespread.com, you can access our daily free play, which we have every day on our main website, as well as all of our top confidence premium bets. So, heading into today's MLB video play of the day. We have a matchup over here in the National League between the Washington Nationals and the Pittsburgh Pirates. The Washington Nationals have gotten off to a strong start this season, standing 24 and 13 overall, and they've been very successful on the road, standing 12 and 6 away from their home field. The Pittsburgh Pirates, on the other hand, are standing more in the lower tier of the NL Central, standing 16 and 22 overall. They have faced more of a road-heavy slate, and the Pirates have been a little bit better on their home field, standing 8-7 and seven at home. The Nationals are coming off of a 6-5 win against the Philadelphia Phillies, where they went on to win that series against Philadelphia two games to one. Winning series has been a rather consistent theme with the Washington Nationals throughout the regular season thus far, and that's allowed them to build themselves a nice lead over there in the NLE, standing eight games clear of second place team, the New York Mets. It also helps Washington's case that all the other teams in the NL East right now are hovering in that 14 to 16 win range while they have 24 wins currently. Washington has just been downright lethal on the offensive side of the ball this season, ranking first in baseball in runs scored. Uh, right now, putting up 224 runs on the year. They're first in the league in batting average, first in on-base percentage, and first in slugging percentage. And if the Nationals continue to put up these kind of numbers throughout the regular season, they're going to have themselves just a tremendous campaign. And they're going to really run away with things over here in the uh, NL East. Pitching hasn't been quite as strong as the batting, but... Washington is seeing um, strides of growth on that side of the ball as well with their team earned runner average. Uh, they currently rank 19th right now in baseball, and they are actually first in baseball in total uh, number of quality starts for their starting pitching staff. It's really been more of a situation with their bullpen not coming up to the plate and stepping up their game to match the performances of their starters and offense. Today, the Nationals are going to be sending out 28-year-old right-hander Steven Strasburg, Strasburg on the year has been pretty solid right now, standing with a 3.28 ERA, 3-1 record, 45 strikeouts, and just a 1.16 whip. Strasburg wasn't quite as strong in his last outing, which came at home against the Baltimore Orioles, but uh, Washington was able to still pick up the win by a final of 7-6 to six in that outing as he gave up five earned runs across six innings of work. Uh, that was coming off his prior start where he logged uh, five and two thirds innings, giving up zero runs. So it'll be interesting to see what kind of performance we get out of the 28 year old right-hander in this one, the Pittsburgh pirates, they're coming off back-to-back -back wins on the road against the Arizona diamondbacks. They were able to split that four game series in Arizona after not having a whole lot of success uh, prior to those two wins that we saw out of the Pirates coming off of a prior six-game losing streak, but right now standing in last place in the NL Central, but just six games back right now of the St. Louis Cardinals and what's a pretty competitive division over there in the NL Central. The Pittsburgh Pirates aren't even close to the same kind of offensive threat that the Washington Nationals are as they rank 29th in baseball in run scored, putting up 138 runs on the year thus far. You contrast that to the 224 runs that the Nationals have been able to put up, and you can see quite a stark difference. Um, also, their pitching has been comparable to the Nationals thus far right now, ranking 15th in baseball and team earned run average. Um, but right now they're only 28th in batting average again, so you would expect if they continue to have a 28th ranking in batting average against with their pitching that that team earned run average is probably going to be creeping up uh, a little bit unless they're able to fix that. Batting average against number. Today, the Pittsburgh Pirates are going to be sending out their 24-year-old righty, Chad Cool, and on the year, he has not been great right now, sitting with a 5.81 ERA and a not-so-great 1.61 whip. In his last outing on the road against the L.A. Dodgers, he was able to log five innings, giving up six hits, four earned runs, two walks to four strikeouts. And Chad just... You know, he's had a couple of decent starts here and there, but he's also had some really poor outings, which has ballooned his ERA up to 5.81 on the year overall. So uh, heading into this matchup against the best offensive team in baseball, 
is certainly not going to be easy here for the Pittsburgh starter. So right now, we see Washington coming to this one as rather significant favorites at about minus 160 on the money line. This has risen from minus 140 where it initially opened. But even at the minus 160 point, we still feel really confident in what Washington is going to be able to do here. Their offense just completely outshines Pittsburgh, and they also have the uh, significant edge on the mound today. And this is also a Washington squad that has been very strong on the road this year. So we are going to go ahead and side with the Washington Nationals to go on and win this one straight up, taking that minus 160 on the money line. Um, also, if you're feeling a little bit more confident and want to take a little bit more of a risk, Washington on the run line is also a decent bet to consider, especially given what they're able to do on the offensive side of the ball. So that's going to be our MLB video play of the day, guys. Uh, for more of this pick video content, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Check out our NBA video play of the day and also check out our main website, stumpthespread.com, which I'll link in the video description to access our daily free play as well as all of our top confidence premium bets. So thanks for stopping on in, guys, and we hope to see you in future videos. Bye.